of fear it is because through this emotion we actually seek energy to run our lives it is this emotion which gives you so much energy which gives you you know so much passion so much motivation it really gives you the sense of protection to protect yourselves not only physically but in many other ways for example when people feel that their identity is threatened, or your land is threatened, your language is threatened, your culture is you know, under threat, or even your religion is under threat, how do you respond? How do you respond to these threats? It's this emotion of fear that actually allows you to defend your identity, to defend your land, to defend your language, your culture, and your religion. Oftentimes, you know, when you want to guide someone, when you want to guide your own children, when you want to educate your own children, when you want to defend your own homeland and culture, it's this, you know, subtle emotion of fear which is actually motivating you. Because you have concerns, you have fears, and these concerns are usually valid, and so the human being finds the motivation from this.